previously on The Walking Dead. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think <coughs> people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. <laughs> What's up? Is Duck feeling all right? We didn't. We didn't shoot the zombie in time. Really? I could have killed you. I had you while you were rummaging around in the front there. I know you did what you did for a reason, and part of me understands. The other part sees you with your back turned to me and knows I could have killed you. I need to go. What about Duck? What about it? Look, Kitty, it's something we're gonna have to deal with. Did you not hear Cat? We don't know shit, Lee. Let's fucking And that's a problem. Mom, let's see if she'll move. He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. What is up guys, it is your boy, the Great Insane Reaver, also known as the Insane Reaver, also known as Sam. It doesn't matter which, because they're all me. I'm in the midst of an identity crisis, don't judge me. But anyway, last time we killed Duck and Katja shot herself in the head. Let's find out what happens this time, shall we? Let's do this. What the fuck, cat? Ain't that some shit? You need a hug, bud. Go talk to Clementine, she'll give you a hug. Chugga 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 choo choo! Choo choo! Whoa! Really? Damn you and your camera angles! Asshole! You wanna talk? Uh uh. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think it's about? What Chuck said. Chuck say. That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did. I swear. Sorry. I took some sense into it. Don't be mad. You prick. Hey. How you doing? I don't 
care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. Cause she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then... I have a plan. Uh... We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. <laughs> Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a man, <laughs> for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Like a gun. Are you kidding me? What? She's too young to handle one? There ain't too young. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> you gotta consider her smart. a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell yeah, you that's actually true. job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plant, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. <laughs> a few moments later. I like a drink, you know. Yeah. Got any? No. Nah. <laughs> He's safe up here. You betcha. Yeah, I'm glad I have you now. I thought I lost the only person that I could have short, hilarious conversations with. Oh. <sighs> Grab a map. I could buy you for a second, Kitty. Can you just leave me alone? God dang it. I want the map! You prick! Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you going to be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. See ya. <laughs> oh, that's messed up. I think I see what needs to happen here. It's a fifth of whiskey. I'm thinking I give this to homeless guy, and then homeless guy somehow gets me into where I can get the map so that I can talk to Clemen and Mammon and Mammon in time. I'll uh, talk to you later, Kenny. Hey, bud, I got a fifth whiskey. You want a fifth whiskey? I got a fifth whiskey. You can have. You can have a fifth whiskey. You know. You know. You know. Hey, yo. Really? I found this if you want it. Damn! Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Sure. <laughs> Ooh. Not known for its finish. A little kid. <laughs> Damn. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. <laughs> oh, you know that Kenny's gonna wanna take this, take the edge off. 
Check wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. boy. Now get that map. Ha <laughs> ha! Level up! And now we talk to Clementine. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. <sighs> what for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still eh, want to talk sweat to it. me? Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you doing out here? I, uh... Couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was <laughs> thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. Yeah, <laughs> that might be. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. Oh, Kenny would. See you. Kenny would end yeah. you, bud. In a heartbeat. And you're on a moving train. So there are plenty of creative and horribly painful ways to end you. Just FYI. Let's get the scissors. Yeah. We got it. We got this. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Precautions. No worries, okay, what should we do? Well, I'm gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh... Tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. Good. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about yeah. it. He's probably had it pretty rough. You need to learn to protect yourself. You need to yourself. know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, no. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But it's know just the stuff. It all the time, and don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See, it's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, <laughs> you look right down the top through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? These are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. Might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah. He looks so surprised. He sounds so calm, but his eyes are so surprised. He's like, why am I saying all this? Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. <laughs> you okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yes. Yeah, you do. Oh. 
Uh. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Okay, a little higher. <laughs> Steady now. Almost got it. I can't. I can't see. Close. Now keep it steady. <laughs> Are those the bullet holes on the box? A bit to the right. I'm operating on the assumption that those are the bullet holes on the box. Aim more to the right. Steady now. Almost got it. I can't. I can't see where it's hitting. A little bit more to the left. Aim lower. Boom! Yeah! You. Excellent. Good shot. Got it. Stop locking your elbows. Dang it. Bit to the right. A little bit lower. There you go. Nice. Okay. So those weren't bullet holes. They were just sketchiness in the box. Stop locking your elbows. I did it. Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're <laughs> not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. <laughs> not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. -uh. Of course, we did just use a fuck ton of bullets. Dang it. Hey, Clint. Let's, let's get Hi. a plan. Let's get a plan. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Yeah. We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Okay, we'll look for them. Really? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can stay Damn it. there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to us. We're gonna wanna look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a good chunk of savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called <laughs> the M M something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it. So we'll head there. Yes. You think we have a good plan? Oh boy. I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Sure. Go ahead. Hey, we need to cut your hair, Hi. Clem. Snip, snip. Uh, you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? 
<laughs> we have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. <laughs> Are you saying it smells? No. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short yeah. so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. <laughs> we gotta do this, this now. I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. It keeps you alive, Clem. It keeps you alive. Do you know how to do this? I really don't. How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my so gosh. You did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. Uh, I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. I didn't tell her. No, it's different. But you do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. I was sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? <laughs> uh, yeah. Everybody <laughs> should have hair thingies. There, all set. Does it look <laughs> dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. feel good better <laughs> I'm glad we have a plan and you're a good little chef thanks I guess we should see how far oh shit hold on everybody <laughs> <laughs> of course and on that note <sighs> Well, looks like we got Clem trained up to shoot some zombie heads. We've got a plan, and she's a lot harder to grab now because her hair is all short and tied up in, like she said, hair thingies. So, if you like this episode of Thriller Thursdays The Walking Dead, slap that like button down below. Seriously, just pound it until it crumbles into dust and then leave a comment telling me what you thought of this episode and subscribe for more epic gameplays and funny moments and all that awesome gaming shenanigans that you guys love all right guys this has been the insane reaper have a great week keep it crazy peace out